Um, hi, my name is Jensen. I'm doing a book by Rick Riordan. This is the second book in the Lost Hero series. It is also just another add-on for the um, Percy Jackson series. And um, to me, this is a really great book. Um, yeah, and um, so the first book was about um, this guy named Jason, and he lost his memory, and he was part of a Roman camp. And, but um, Juno or um, Hera put erased his memory and put him in the half blood, which is Greek, so to um, help with the um, prophecy. And I'm going to read you that in a second. And um, she also erased Percy Jackson's memory and put him in the Roman camp at Camp Jupiter. And here's the um, prophecy. Seven half-bloods shall answer the call. To storm or fire, the world must fall. An oath kept with the final breath, and foes bear arms to the doors of death. And, um, uh, the, this book I would rate, like, five out of five, because it is really good, but if you're not really into stories that go up and down, then I would not really not consider reading this because it has some funny parts to sad parts to boring parts to ex like exhilarating parts and um to me i read like 100 pages in a day it was so good and um so um i will read the back of this just to give you a brief in the Lost Hero, three demigods named Jason, Piper, and Leo made their first visit to Camp Half-Blood, where they inherited a bl blood-chilling chill quest, which was the seven half-bloods shall answer the call. But who are the other four mentioned in the prophecy? prophecy? The answer may lie in another camp miles away, where a new camper has shown up and appears to be the son of Neptune, god of the sea, which is Percy Jackson. And, um, like I said, I would really encourage you to read this. Um, it is, it has some really funny parts. There's a lot of new characters, a lot of, and instead of, like, saying Juno and Zeus and stuff, they use the Roman names, like, Her like, Juno, Jupiter, and, like, Mars. And, um, so, yeah. Why do you suppose he wrote those books? Um, well, it said, um, I can't remember where I read it, but it was in, like, the Lost Hero book and the, about the author. He wrote all this about his kid because, um, his son was dyslexic, dyslexic and had ADHD. And, um, he couldn't focus, he couldn't sit still. So he wrote a story about a kid and Percy, J kid Percy Jackson and his life through demi demigods and gods. And there is also a new book coming out called a Wrath of Athena, I think. And it's the third book in the series. Mark of Athena. And it is the third book in the series. And it is when the Great Prophecy um, happens. And um, I would like to just read it and do a book talk on that. So thank you.